Uncle Sam's future admirals are on the march at the world-famed Naval Academy in Maryland. To these traditional grounds come the pick of the youth of America and its possessions. Men of destiny fighting to find their place under the red, white, and blue. Against this colorful background of comradeship and achievement, of prowess in the classroom and on the athletic field, transpires one of the finest human dramas ever to reach the screen. The story of three men who together found glory and adventure. One, a son of wealth. I have my appointment to the Naval Academy, Annapolis. Another, a small town football hero. Is it it? It's it. And the third, an enlisted sailor. I made it. Ha <laughs> ha! I made it! Shame to take this rigging off. It's catnip to women. Ash does most of the dancing for our room. Mm -hmm. Yes, in fact, I have to take care of all the social amenities. The truck's too busy trying to be an admiral. Yeah. Ash is more like a Marine. He lands, and in five minutes, he has the situation well in hand. <laughs> See? You know who I am, mister? Yes, sir. You're a double-bilging slug by the name of Harnett, who keeps a maple paddle in his room to use on plebes half his size. Meet me in the gym in 15 minutes, mister, and be prepared to fight. A pleasure, sir. And I'm going to knock your block off, sir. Getting into the academy meant everything to me. I felt that my father's name would keep me out. But with the commission and 40 years of service ahead of me, I knew that somehow, someday, I could clear his name. <laughs> 